Hello there, viewers, and of course, welcome back to my garage, where it has actually been busy. There has been a massive update to the base game with some bug fixes and everything else, but a new vehicle has landed. I am over at the used car lot, and it is in here. It took forever to get it spawned here because I would like it to be used, not uh, a ruin or junk from the junkyard. I would like to see it in its full glory, and it is in here. And there has been a massive update to the mods. I'm not saying all the mods are had updates some have had updates they always do have updates but there's a new vehicle thanks to the modders and it is awesome and i can't wait to actually show you that hopefully in the next episode but for this episode before i continue please go ahead and subscribe to the channel like the video comment down below and if you would like, you can share my content. So let's begin. Ready? Are you ready? You sure? Have you subscribed? If you are, you're going to feel happy. So here we go. Look at it. It's beautiful. And it's pink. It's pink. Why is it pink? I don't know why it's pink, but it's a motorbike. Awesome. <laughs> this is stated as the L500. So let's go over to it. I'm going to buy it straight away. Uh, if you take that E out, that spells something else. I just noticed that. Here we go. The car model. I hope that gets changed to uh, motorbike or bike model. L500 engine 500cc gearbox 5. It has got the clean start, rust, cutter condition, and overall condition. So it's basically portrayed like a car. That's why the car model is up there. Let's go ahead and buy. This is fantastic. I have been in Discord and this has been mentioned quite a few times as a suggestion. And it is now finally in the actual game. It is still being worked on. So please keep that in mind. I am... A few days late for this. Unfortunately, I've had the weekend off. And Monday, just a little holiday. But I'm back in action. When this bike got released, the paintwork, or shall I say the bodywork, wouldn't rust. Now, as you can see, rust is on. You can chrome this bike as well. Some parts didn't like it and it worked fine on others. I believe some of the chrome parts, what didn't like it is now fixed. But we'll sort that out in a bit because I'm going to chrome it all. I just would like to see what it looks like having everything chromed on a vehicle. And with this being a small vehicle, it's perfect. So let's go ahead and where's the kickstarter? There's the kickstarter. Here we go. Oh, uh, am I actually facing it right? Or is the kickstarter actually bust? Let's go to the ignition. Switch that. Oh, no, it's not doing anything. I have to actually uh, say, I've got experience riding motorbikes, but unfortunately, 
automatic basically start the engine twist and go no gearing no kick starters so no experience there let's go ahead all right no come on thank you yeah you can actually carry this beauty i wouldn't have thought you could it looks like a chunky motorbike or do you say motorcycle let's go ahead plonk you there oh okay then my just pick you up a little bit there we go that is good mind you a lot of things are going to be of course replaced on this and i am going to buy all the stuff what i need to do this here there is the wrench. I'll buy that. And I'll buy that. And you. And that's it for now. I'm going to keep all these items here. So if I do come back to the shop, because obviously I'm playing, or should I say, I'm doing a story mode at the moment. And unfortunately, my desk is down at the uh, small house in the woods. Take you off. There we go. And put you there. And let's go ahead. Take the rust off. Like I said are still things to be worked on and I can't de-rust that okay then so let's go ahead and buy fender so I'm looking at the L500 body fender front I don't think I need to paint this I would like to go ahead and chrome it. There we go. And voila! That is awesome. So I can actually get rid of this now. And the rust has literally just been uh, added to this. I believe today or yesterday. So that is alright. So let's put that there. Let's get you out of the way. Put you there. And let's go ahead and get the forks off, shall we? So I need to get the wheels off. Go. And you and you'll fall. Obviously, there isn't anything for you to stand on. Let's go ahead and here. I know that you need place. Can I get to the light? Take that off. Take that off. Oh. Bell off. Brilliant. That is actually good. So, let's go ahead. Put you there. And I... Hmm, pry tool. I'm just wondering if I can actually take this apart. So let's go like that. There we go, we can has actually got a light in it already which is fantastic so let's go ahead chrome that up right i will say this having the engine parts and other parts as that price for a car i would actually go ahead and say yeah that is reasonable but this little dinky dink 
I don't think so. It will be nice to have size difference prices, but keep it nice and easy. I can understand why you would just do it as engine parts and other parts. Put you back on. That is the light done. So I need to go ahead and get a suspension. Lost my train of thought there. Where I wanted to go. So I need the shock absorbers. From right and from left. There we go. And as you can actually see, the name has come up there. Did I notice that this didn't? Yeah, mirror one R. So it seems if it's spawned in as normal, as you can see here, the uh, names of the parts aren't coming up properly. But if you buy the parts, as you can see here, they do. These look chromed already, to be honest. There we go. I don't know what else to actually say. It does look chrome, though. So, drop you. No ka -ching. That's fine. Now, can I chrome the uh, L... Can I? Right. If I actually remember the name correctly, and it is this bit here. The red bit what pivots for the steering. So, I need to get all that off. And then I can actually go, you know what? The front is actually uh, complete. So, remove you, you there. And... Where is... Oh, it's... Wait, why is it... Like that. Okay then. Right, here we go. Let's get the small parts up here. So I don't lose them in the ground. I need the speed monitor off or gauge. I need the ignition side off. There we go. As well as clutch and brake. There we go. So you come off. You can come off. That's the handlebar free now. There we go. That is good. And, oh, no, that was the gauge. Where's the handlebar? There are more bolts. Could be. Yeah, there's four. There we go. You off. And you off. There. You up. Yeah, as you can see, just mirror one R, but. I am looking at, where are you? There you go. This part, triple tree. What I was on about. So let's go ahead and see if I can chrome you. Yes, I can. That's brilliant. And can I chrome the handlebars? Yes, I can. So let's go ahead and put this back together. So that goes like that. And that looks different. Oh no, it was this side. Okay. Oh, no, no, don't. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Game, please work with me. Right, so that is now attached. Don't knock it because I don't want it to be attached. Let's go ahead and tighten that bolt up, tighten that up, and then put it on the desk. There you go. Awesome. Now, which one are you? Are you the... 
English inside? Or were you a light? Light. There we go. So let's put you here. There we go. And don't do that. Can we just please just. Yes! That's what I want. You just stay like that. And you. It's difficult to actually say what part is which because the information is all missed information at the moment. Alright. <laughs> what? I can chrome the gauge. Alright, that, that's fine. And put you there. And you like that. Wait a sec, no. The ignition is the left side. The lights are the right side. And I do believe the clutch is left and the front Alright, I know there's brakes at your foot, but is that the back brakes and the brakes were on here is for the front? And that was that one. Okay then. I have to actually check in the catalog because of course I can't see the actual uh, information. And this is just by memory I could be wrong let's put you like that so that is the light on so the handlebars are fine that's it that's done so what do I need to actually do next I put you on here I can might cause it to jump about there we go put that side on I'm trying to get most of it attached to whatever it needs to be attached to and then I can actually build the bike in blocks like this is the front block because it's all, oh wow, okay then, it's all about the uh, front part of the actual bike. So let's do like that. So, all what that needs now is the wheel and rim and the brakes. That's alright, okay then, so let's go ahead look in engine oh uh okay then uh you thank you what do i need confirm uh accessories brake lever and there's the uh Clutch level lever, sorry. Handle bar, yeah. Handle right and left. Where? And brake pedal, which goes at the bottom of your foot. Saying that in a questionable way, because I don't know 100%. Yeah, I can't actually. Uh, see a different pedal or anything else all right that is fine let's go ahead and have a look at bike itself I think it will be best to actually bring this here right let's lower you down you 
And I have got a question. Obviously, in game, this will go on to the rim dismantler, where it actually detaches fire from the rim. But this is actually my question because I don't know half of the mechanical side to a bike because I've always had my bikes maintained for me. Is there a different machine for the actual motorbike tires? Because they're thinner than the cars, including the rims. I just didn't know if there was a machine for uh, a motorbike and car. Right, I... Ooh! I need to take this entirely apart, don't I? So I need the kickstand to come off. I do. And I need a new one anyway. That's fine. Let's go ahead and buy a stand body. Stand. Thank you. And do you call the bike body, the bike frame, or chassis. So let's go ahead. No, can't chrome that, that's okay. So let me put that there. I guess I just had a train of thought there. Can I do this? Again, please don't. Oh, <laughs> drop, can I drop, no, okay then, I actually thought because it was smaller and I could lift it and drop it, it could just chrome everything up, whilst it was still attached, but no, it can't do that, let's get the engine and the exhaust off first so that is you oh don't like it right can't chromalize you is that even a word chromalize oh it should be i'm chromalizing this motorbike up <laughs> so i need the rear fender and that looks good let's go ahead you there good chromed that up now do i take this all apart because it will make this video longer but it will allow me to actually show you which parts can be chromed at this moment in time because like i said this bike is being worked on exactly the same as the same can be said for the actual entire game itself as well so let's get these uh, covers off the uh, pedal as well there we go I don't know if these covers can actually be chrome. Yes, they can. That is good. Who's there? And we'll get into the nitty gritty of the actual uh, bike itself. So I need to find any bolt I can. That's the air filter. That's okay. That can go up there. Carburetor. Thank you, it's fine. Hmm, did say engine parts. Nope. Okay then. Saves me a bit of money there. Got a minute. So, I need you to come away from the frame. And you as well. That's feet. You know what? It looks good. 
I can put that there. And you come off. You and the chain can come off. I think this is a mistake. Yeah, of course it is. Why would you throw my chain? You wouldn't, would you? I don't think it would actually work in real life anyway, to be honest. So let's see. That is off. But I don't see why I need it off. That can stay there. I need you. Come here. And go there. So that cover is alright. So put you there and you there so I know that you're together. And I do you. No, can't do you. And then so let's put you there. What else can I take off? So that is one pedal block there, that pedal there. Can I... Yes, I can! Oh, I'm questioning myself if I can or cannot. Got a minute. Oh, this is just insane. Who would actually chrome in higher by? I would. <laughs> that, that, that's who. I would. Oh, realistically... In real life right that has got rust on it and it's got fuel in it so I'm going to you there I think all the fuel would actually uh, leak out because I took it apart now shock absorber has to come off I'm wondering if Frame can actually be chromed. There we go. That. Oh, totally forgot the uh, name of this now. I have to recap my memory. There we go. That is done. So that can go there. It seems like the frame can actually be done. And swing arm. There you go. Keep saying pedals, but they're pegs. That's fine. And I need the actual fuel tank. That's the engine. Gas tank. Go. So let's chrome this up. There we go. Brilliant. Get in there, people. Get in there. And I can't believe I haven't even asked. How insane am I today? How is everybody uh, doing? What did you uh, get up to uh, over the weekend? Hopefully you had a fantastic weekend with uh, family or friends. Or just being on your own. I'm not going to criticise. And I need you. And I'm looking for other bolt. I can actually remove. Yes, there you go. That is. Oh, actually. Wait a moment. Brake pedal. Okay then. Can't do anything for that. That's all right. Man. Uh, shop owner, I am so sorry that I'm cluttering your uh, shop up, but need you. That, I can actually see needs to be worked on inside. Wow, that's going to be a chore because they're so tiny, all the parts are. Right, I need this shock absorber. Oh, I need this off first. And is this the Kickstarter? No, it's the gear lever. And it looks absolutely horrible. So let's go ahead and get a new gear lever. 
There we go. Yeah, you can tell the difference straight away. So that is mangled, so that can go there. And can I chrome it up? To be honest, it actually looks shiny and chromey to start with, so that's fine. Right, can I drop you and pick you up? There we go, get the shock absorber off. There we go. And I need to drop you again. Get low to the ground. So I can see where the darn bolts are for these. Unless you and I was right. They just pop off. And they look fine. There you go. Uh I did just chrome that, can I? Okay then, so put you there. It doesn't look good. Put you there. Put you there and you there man i'm spending a lot of money on this there's nothing attached to this so let's go ahead and go ahead really what what are you insane i can basically chrome near enough anything else Apart from that, man, that's bad. But I need the body so I can get cover A and B. And let's see. There we go. That did work. So I can put you there and pick you up. And you. Our beauty! This is just absolutely amazing. So let's go ahead and get this body back together, shall we? So I need to hopefully put this upside down if the game allows it. And I don't think it is because it looks like it's got a bit of a Oh, it worked. A bit of a jet. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's a uh, collision bot. Seems a bit off. Okay, then. At least I know what I'm working with. So let's go ahead. Get you put back on the back. There we go. And I reckon if you really wanted to. It'll cost you a bit, though. You could actually build this bike from scratch. There you go. So I need you on there. There you go. That is good. And let's flip you over. Because it seems like everything is connecting to this frame nicely. A car would actually have difficulty doing this. But this is actually going alright, actually, to be honest. So, front is you. Don't. Oh, Luminec. Okay. Might. Oh. Let's just put that there. I grab you. Get the gas tank there. That is fine. And tighten you up. Now's it. That's fine. Yeah, I'm over here and I'm pushing it. So, yeah, the uh, collision box isn't 100% on this. I can tell just from that. The rear fender can go there. Right, you up. Awesome. 
the covers. I don't know which side goes where, but I do now. Because, lucky for me, I actually got it right this time. And there. That's okay. Man, this is going to be a little bit janky. I'll tell you that one thing. So let's put you out of the way. Which one was the rear? You're the rear. Okay then. And let's have a look in the catalogue because I cannot see any tyres for the actual uh, bike or rims. Let's go ahead and accessories. Nope, none in there. Interior. Nothing there apart from a beige seat. Suspension. Here we go. Thought I did see them. So we've got R19s. And I do believe them tyres and rims said R50. So you, 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 you. There we go. Wait. Where's the, oh, the other one's there. I need to go and get these fixed up. Okay, here I am. We all know how this actually works, but I'm going to actually show you because it is actually new. Put you there and get the tire. Put you there and put you on. Brilliant. There we go. And I need a pump. There we go. And let's see. Where are you? There we go. Pump these up. This is for the front, which is awesome. And this is the rear. Ah, there you go. Easy and simple how we actually want life to be really to be honest when it's not so let me just take these back right so let's get the pegs on or not put you like that right okay then. let's see i place you like that so you can fall why do you always fall this way right something is going on because each time this kind of bugs out like it is doing now the frame rate just plummet there we go so i tighten these up Yes, I did. There we go. And nah, I won't be able to watch any of that. So let's go ahead and get the stand on. There we go. Perfect. Don't need to do anything else there. Brake pedal. And there. Where's the bolt for it? Can't see it. Ah, there it is. There we go. That is hatched. You are the fuel line, carburetor, air filter, and you are the gear lever. Don't know if this hatched is actually frame where it actually attached to the uh, engine mount so yeah it looks like the engine mount that's all right it's fine put you there let's look at you i need you off so i can actually attach you to the new rear rims and Tires. That should actually come off. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Right, put you there. 
Um, I need you. Loosen. Thank you. Um, you go there. Is there anything else? No, that's it. And oh, the name, the name, name, name has actually eluded me. Oh goodness, great, great drum. That's it. That's what I was actually uh, thinking of. So that can be tightened there. Um, you flip around. So you will rock it. I always actually uh, called these in my head. They're uh, chain holders. The chain wrapped around it and it holds the uh, chain in place. There we go. Um, that looks good. So you can go there and there. Perfect. Wow, it's getting there. It's getting there. I just need to get you settled up there, and hopefully, you will attach, attach. Right, okay, nothing is blocking this. So. So what I'm going to do is cut off here, take this all apart and put it back on to the front. Here we go. It is now finally attached. Sorry I didn't show you it, but I actually showed you already me putting it back together anyhow. So I thought I don't want to bore you, so I'll do it off camera. It didn't take long, but I was right game didn't like it being attached to everything at the same time so i had to put each piece back on bit by bit so let's get you sorted out I can't remember where the trapper is Go. I think it's probably attached to the old. Okay. Right. I was right. It is the caliper. There we go. So I need to put it back on there. And then you and as you can see i've actually got everything attached now at the front and this is what happened to the other new uh shock absorbers i don't know why that has happened they just kind of detached themselves from their own body so caused mayhem now it seems like everything is fine let's get the seat back on there we go and i can actually start on the uh, engine where did i uh ah there you go that's the bolt the seat is now let's go ahead and see if this beauty can stand upright and there we go look at that it's awesome and just looking at it like that it just reminds me of a uh, motorbike brand a Honda can't remember the uh, other name for it. You've got like cars, Honda Civic, Peugeot 20, whatever. But this reminds me of a Honda 
shape of her. Looks beautiful. Love it. Absolutely do. So let's get this engine sorted out, shall we? The alternator looks to be bad. And I don't know what I can actually chrome or can't chrome. So there we go. Yeah. Oh, actually, no, it's not the alternator. That is the alternator, and that's fine. And the rotor for it is chromed. Oh, my goodness me. <laughs> wow. Okay, that is, this is awesome. Right, loosen you up. Can I chrome a gear? No. <laughs> Why would I? <laughs> uh let's see how do i actually take you apart and keep everything kind of like easy to remember how it actually goes back together the kickstarter is bad so let's go and buy that the engine kickstarter you are there start a pedal there we go so this heap of junk can actually go away. Thank you. And I'm running low on fun. Let's do this nice and slowly so I don't actually mistake. So loosen you up. You're the oil cover or something. Oh, wow. The oil filter needs to be placed and yep filter cover and that is where but have i gone past it seriously there are covers there cinder cinder head ah there you go filter cover now can i chrome you whoops Yes, I can. All right. It's actually getting dark. I've spent a whole day, in-game day, getting this bike sorted out and chromed. Okay. So, covers. Let's take you apart. There we go. No. Not there you go. Why aren't you coming off? And nope. Okay then. So, what else is actually touching you? This is. Yeah, you should be coming off. Oh, okay then. Fair dues. No. Why aren't you popping off? Seriously. All right. Let's go in to the actual cinder, shall we? I don't know what the spark plug is like. Nor the piston. Let's get the cover off. Cover's fine. So I can chrome that. That's good. Put you there. And turn you around. Oh, that's the bolt. There. And this should be chromed. And that's where the oil goes. And this little bit of that looks like the oil cap the oil checker so that's fine go no. and starter no I guess anything what is geared can't be chrome all right so let's get into here get the camshaft off There we go. Timing chain looks alright. Cam shaft looks alright. So can I attach the chain? But I would like to see if I can actually chrome. Oh, actually, no, the chain doesn't look alright. Oh, no, yeah, it does. Just me. Right, there you go. Chain. Thank you very much. And 
Can I get rid of you? Yeah. Good. And that is the spark plug. And that is good. Right. Can I... Yes, I can. That is weird. Can I actually fit a performance spark plug in you? So let's buy you and you. There we go. I always think I can pick them up afterwards, straight off the shelf, but I can't. So I need you. Where are you? Where's the cinder gone? Uh, there it is. Right. Loosen you. There you go. And I up these. No. Come on. Ah. Right. The spark plug is out now. Good. I don't know why I always have trouble with the spark plugs. I'm trying to get them out. Now, you can go in. Alright, no. Okay. What's going on here? There. And. Okay. No. Have you. Like that. Leaning. Thank you. And you can go there. Brilliant. And. Item. There we go. Spark plug. Is now in. So let's go ahead and patch the spark wire. There we go. Like, oh, uh, like so. Thank you very much. And the camshaft. Thank you very much. Oh no, not yet. I need that. And then timing chain there. Then the camshaft there. And the cover. There we go. Fantastic. Right. Now. Loosen you up. Head gasket is okay. That's good. The piston looks be alright, I guess. Don't seem it though. Right, let's take you off. Get to the uh, gears and flying wheel. There we go. You off there. Now I need to get to other bolt. So, there we go. Take you all apart. I think that is that. So, this is what I can do with the yeah, crankcase. So that is all bad there. Now is the gears falling out. No, what am I doing? I need to be in here. Uh, engine and crank. Hey, saw them all up here. There we go. It was B, was it? And that is. Yes, B. Right. So, you. And you. Brilliant. So, that. And go there, because that's the middle piece. This the other side. Oh, wow. Crankshaft. Demolished, isn't it? Right, you. Go there, you so put you like that. You like that. And please get the bolts of the piston. Thank you. There we go. And I need a new, yeah, crankshaft. Obviously, where are you? 
crankshaft. There you go. And you are there. Brilliant. So I can actually get rid of you. There you go. You need to be put there. Thank you. Let's go ahead and get the this. Oh, <laughs> okay. I was just about to say, uh, what's going on here? So, right, is the piston and crank shaft now on? So, put you there. Gears look okay, so put you there. That is fine. And then I do leave the starter. Where is the starter? Did have it. Okay. Right. Get you over there. Because if you are just glitching at the moment, you hopefully pop back. When I log back into the game, where's ah? There's the starter, right? Can't remember if the starter came. Ah, it's that block. Okay then, so that's fine. Put you there. The oil is later. Clutch needs place. Go. And that is up here. There you go. Sorted. There, or is this after? Right, must be after. You go there. All right, and let's tighten you up. No, and there you go. So the clutch. Oh. Wait a sec. I'm doing this wrong, aren't I? Right. You. Then. You. There you go. And then. You. Awesome. And can I prune the cinder? There you go. Awesome, there. And that goes on here. But I need to remember. Yeah, this is later. Starter. There. Okay. Getting there, it's coming together. Coordinate a rotor, I think. That part there, so that can go there. And head gasket goes on this one. Okay, you go there. Piston, there you go. And then you, and then you. Awesome. So, alternator is. That bit. I'm sure of it. Okay, then let's turn you round like that. Nope, it's there. Okay, then just wanted to make sure. Go. And um, there we go. And there we go. Oil filter. Remember, does it go in the case, which I do believe it does? And you go there. I think that goes on after the cover. Alright, so I need what now? Oh, yeah, oil filter. So let's have a look for that. 
you there. Good. You can go over here. And then leave. Here, lever. Just touch here, it does. Goes there. Go. That is all the covers. It seems like everything now is actually attached. The engine is now together. So let's go ahead and you up there. That it. I don't have to bolt that together. You there. Go. Get the bolts on this side. There we go. Awesome. All filter is there. There we go. And cover. There we go. And you go there. And then you go there. Is that it? Really, is that it? Lift me up a little bit so I can actually get the last bolt. Yeah, that's... That's it. Ha! Ah! <laughs> That's the engine. Done. How do I get oil into it? Do I really go through that? Yeah, that does not seem right. To be honest. Yeah, it just pops off straight away. Can I please do you like that? Yeah, I can. So, no, I want no. Oh, no, 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 oil! How the... <laughs> where's the... Where's the oil checker? Check oil. It's got oil in it. Um, he's just like... No! No, don't! Alright, put you there. Yeah, surely that's not it. Be able to do something. Can I, um, do parts together. So let's go ahead and pick this up and not knock it. Oh, okay then. Let's put the bottom bit in. Did that just really happen? Right. Yeah, the floors really do need to have a good darn check over. I'll tell you that in this game. Right, there you go. The lower engine is now... I could actually say this is the actual engine. There we go. Right in there. There's nowhere else that needs to be tightened, I don't think so. So, head gasket. Right, okay then, so... I was missing something. I was two steps or at least one step in front of everything. And I totally forgot about the securing bolts. And the head gasket is gone. Okay then, fair dues. Thank you, head gasket, for just vanishing on me again. Let's just buy a new one. It's cheap as anything. So let's go ahead you on and now put the cinder head on there are securing bolts there and there and lower myself down there and there and now I can put the cover on that is where I was going wrong Blimey. Right, there you go. And there you go. Now it's all secure. Now I can put the carburetor on. Here. And then the 
air filler and then fuel line it has got oil in so we know that go and then fuel line there we go um why can't I get probably because I'm too low all right Hold a tick there we go um that is there all done Slow myself down a little bit so I can see underneath yep that looks all fine I don't think there is a uh, oh wait a sec is that fuel it's very yellow but you know what shall we start it oh no <laughs> I haven't actually finished building it yet there we go the exhaust is now on there we go so oh chain there we go why put this on at the wrong time I think I have <laughs> wow what's I saying about me being a uh, few steps ahead can I touch you now yes I can that is weird why yeah that is weird that is not allowing the chain to be attached because the actual wheel is on I can understand the cover being on, on and that actually scared me but as you can hear and see oh wow look at this trail I'm racing along on my... No, I'm not racing. Actually. <laughs> That's me just messing about with their game physics. Oh, it's done. Right, lines. I'm, I'm clicking it like you haven't clicked anything before. Okay. That's weird. Uh, the lights aren't working. But anyhow, this. Enter. Thank you. There we go. And stand. Up, up, up. Why aren't you... Okay then, just why aren't you working? Put you on the side. Okay then. Ignition off, thank you. Why aren't you What is going on? The kickstand. Go away! Don't need you no more. Go away. Go. I don't get it. I just don't get it. This is just terrible. Right. Kick start. Yes. I hope it works whilst it's got the uh, kick stand up. First. Oh, wow. I'm riding a motorbike. Yes! It works! It bloody works! Going to do. I'm a ghost rider. Ghost rider riding along. Oh my goodness me. I chromalized a motorbike. And it worked! Oh, goodness me! This actually worked. No kickstand. I might actually just remove that kickstand if it don't work when I uh, reload the game. 
But there you go, there you have it. It's beautiful. It really is beautiful. All right, let's go ahead and park up in here. Oh, the camera's a bit weird. You know what? Yeah, it is. Got the Leo. There we go. <laughs> Ignition. Yeah, the lights on. It's not even clicking. I might have missed the wire or something, but there we go. <laughs> I am so happy. Yeah. A chrome motorbike. Awesome. And this is the end of the episode. Finally, after... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. You gotta be kidding me. Oh. I just looked over at my recording. It is at 1 hour 26 minutes. I wanted to get a bike up and running from scratch in one episode and it's a long episode so I do apologize about that but there you have it a chromed motorbike the L500 thank you very much for watching and hopefully you'll see me in the next one bye